There's a real and growing movement in the United States for trans rights. And as someone who opposes government intervention and control over our lives, I'm starting to understand that it, there's no place for the government to be in my life telling me what sex or gender I am. There's no place for them to tell me that I have to fill out on a card what race I look like. I don't appreciate being treated as someone you can just look at and make a whole bunch of judgments like you know me. But the biggest thing that is really starting to grind my gears is the fact that the government thinks they can dictate my age. Time is a construct. Just like so many other things in our society, gender, roles, power is a construct. Money is more bullshit than anything else because it's just trash. We, we can make toilet paper, we can make money. Either one wipes your ass just fine. But the fact that the government thinks that they can come into my house and tell me that I don't identify as a 65-year-old man after all the poison in the food and the EMF waves that are bombarding me all the time. Every Wi-Fi network is just broadcasting into my brain and further degrading my central nervous system. There's microplastics in the water. I might have to eat lab-grown meat soon. They're pumping me full of nut oils and nut milk. Ha! Huh. Where's the where's the nipple? I didn't even know that nuts had nipples or any of the other equipment to produce milk. It doesn't seem natural. Therefore, we are no longer aging naturally. I pretty much went from a 20-something year old healthy youthful man to being, I have a strong desire to sit on my porch and yell at children that come near my grass. And yet the government tells me, no, you haven't gotten there yet. You haven't earned the right to be on your porch, living your dream, being the best version of yourself. What are my pronouns? R retiree? R retired? I don't care. I want the freedom that comes along with being able to identify with the race that I feel like, with the sex or gender that I feel like, and also with the age group that I identify with. I can't go hang out with old people if everybody in the group is 65 plus and I'm there the judgment and the separation the discrimination the age based discrimination that I can't do anything about is going to be present older people are not always accepting of new and better ideas because they get butt hurt that we have come up with a better way to do things they want to stonewall they want to say no you can't do that it's against the rules this is how we did it back in my day and because you have to respect your elders I can't say hey listen geezer that's not the way things work anymore. We don't let the government come in and dictate what our 
gender is. We don't come in and just willingly accept this control that you previous generations have been more than happy to allow big government to just control every part of your life. So they don't want to see the next generation be more free to be able to do what would fulfill them because they had a miserable, sad, pathetic life and they think that the, the best way to make themselves feel whole before they go in a hole in the ground is to ruin it for everybody else. Make sure that everybody else is aim under the same thumb of control that they spent their life under. And it's this type of ignorance that causes the cycle to continue. Now, if, if, if I can identify as the way I feel, I am an old soul. But I guess that doesn't matter to the government. But if I could identify as a 90-year-old man, then these elders that think that they are the ones that must be respected and listened to would have to sit down and listen to Grandpa Justin explain to them all the things that are making people in America sad, it's leading to a mental height, mental health epidemic in this country. And yet no one wants to be accepting. No one wants to be tolerant. We all want to fight about everything. Our worst tribal instincts are driving this government support, this blind government support. Pass more laws pass more laws we want more laws we want more rules don't let them get away with that oh they're watching terrible things and the music is awful well if i could come in in a position of seniority i could speak with these people i could commune with them and i'm 100 percent positive that we could find a solution and work this out 